Hey guys, welcome back. Today we discuss Guy Ritchie's The Covenant. The Covenant stars Jake Gyllenhaal as U.S. Sergeant John Kinley. He leads a team of soldiers specializing in locating and destroying weapons of mass destruction. Along the way, we meet fellow star Dar Salim as Ahmed, an Afghan interpreter with a bit of an edge and a mysterious backstory. Make no mistake, this is a war drama, a combat action flick with all the social and political controversy that entails. Some sequences even have a game-like feel with fast-paced shooting and explosions galore, but it will be far too simplistic to reduce it simply to that. This is a film about loss and sacrifice on a deeply personal level. It's about honor and survival, not simply for oneself or country, but for one's family. The actors really shine in this film. Their performances convey not merely the strength of their character's character, but their emotional and physical endurance and growth, notably earned over the course of the film. We get an excellent sense of who they are, their brokenness, their short-sightedness, their humanity, but also what they're capable of, which is developed over time as they're pushed to the brink. And forced to overcome challenges naturally and progressively and not without moments of fear and doubt and failure. The visuals, costumes, and set designs make for an immersive backdrop to this experience, especially in the first half. In this environment, no one is safe. Where the film does lose a bit of its energy is in the second half, when the story shifts to a different perspective and the story becomes a bit more repetitive and predictable. We're introduced to a different kind of challenge, one familiar to anyone having to deal with the government and its bureaucracy. This is where Richie's own agenda, or perhaps a better way to put it, is his own self-righteous indignation gets in the way of good storytelling, pivoting to more of a literal commentary and condemnation of government operation. And that's not to suggest his point isn't being made with this film, or that it shouldn't be made at all. Every good story has a morality tale, but the writers put their bias before advancing the story any further, and in doing so, I feel like they lost sight of what to do with these characters, to make their point, but to do so in an entertaining way. By the end, the film does get back on track though, and is ultimately a fulfilling conclusion to an emotional roller coaster of a tale, albeit a bit bombastic and over the top at times. In true Richie fashion. All in all, The Covenant is definitely worth the watch. I would recommend it. You don't have to necessarily enjoy war movies or things of that nature to enjoy this one. This is a movie about the human experience. But hey, those are my thoughts. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.